Uh, thank you for introduction. Uh, my name is Ryusuke Kuroki, and we talked about uh, uh, session three. Uh, in session three, uh, presenters mentioned these SDGs goals, and today we discussed this relationship, uh, focused on goal one, seven, eleven, and thirteen. And uh, we selected some targets from these goals, uh, two targets from each, each goals, and uh, we used all uh, goal one target. And uh, we talked. Uh, there, are there any uh, co-benefit, uh, neutral, or trade-off? And uh, this is our opinion. Uh, it is uh, context-depending, but uh, there, uh, in our discussion, there was an uh, opinion about uh, this, uh, these targets. Uh, we think uh, target 1.1 and uh, goal 7, target 7.1 and 7.2 is uh, co-benefit uh, if it is uh, context depending and uh, when uh, we can uh, we can say this is uh, co-benefit uh, we uh, this is the context uh, we think uh, first uh, achieve goal 7.1 by ensuring the access to energy uh, it could help to reduce poverty and uh, if renewable energy production in local scale have potential to create income to reduce poverty. And uh, this is also context depending, uh, but uh, we think uh, target 1.1 and target 11.6 uh, is a trade-off, we can think. Uh, why uh, we think this is trade-off? Um, this is our context. Uh, if uh, consumption structure remains the same, uh, more service to reduce the poverty, but will have more impact on environment. And one important element in evaluating them is uh, distribution of resources. Uh, for example, uh, where the tax gathered by government give to where and benefit whom. Uh, like this, uh, this is our opinion. And uh, one of our results, uh, we have to consider uh, directions, context, area, governance, and economics uh, when we think relationship these uh, goals and targets. Thank you very much.